Hey guys, welcome back to High Yield Intraday Trading. I hope every one of you is doing good. So before we start discussing today's topic, let me request you all to subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking on the subscribe button here. Once you click on it, you will get the confirmation on the left bottom corner. Post you subscribe to my channel. Also make sure to press the bell icon and click on all. You will get the confirmation on the left bottom corner so that whenever I upload a video, you get the notification about the same without any messes. Also, I would request you all to subscribe to my telegram channel with the name HYIT intraday calls because I share a lot of things over there and it might be helpful to you in some way or the other all right so as I had informed in my earlier video today I will put forward three questions related to the stock market and you need to do the needful for winning the HYIT's happy hours quiz contest and if you are not aware about the rules and the other stuffs related to the quiz contest then i would request you all to watch my previous video wherein i have mentioned everything in details okay so let's get on to the questions let's get started with the questions so the first question the first thing that you need to do here is you need to get on to the chart of pel that is piramal enterprises and then change the time frame to a one day time frame and then go back to the month of July 2016 that is 2016 once that is done now on my screen you see a highlighted portion right so the question is what are the dates on which the candlesticks are making a bearish piercing pattern on the chart now to answer this question you need to be aware about what a bearish piercing pattern is and also you need to get onto the charts to see the exact dates so do your homework and then answer the question moving on to the second question on my screen you see a highlighted portion again now within that highlighted portion there is an instance wherein the stock has given a big gap up opening so the question is post that gap up opening how many days did the stock take to close that gap moving on to the third question on my screen you see three types of charts the first one is a bar chart the second one is a renko chart and the third one is a line chart now the question is out of these three chart types which chart type takes only the help of the closing price in order to plot itself and when i say only the closing price it means that we are avoiding the opening prices the high prices and the low prices of that particular stock so these are the three questions guys and you have time till coming friday that would be 11th of september 2020 to answer the questions post that we will do the needful from our end as explained in my previous video all right so thank you so much for all your time and patience guys i hope you all have a fabulous weekend stay home stay safe and i will see you all later bye bye